In June of 1986, the Emerald Coast Joint Venture purchased 21,000 acres in South Walton and announced plans to develop the area. Since then, the company decided it could not afford 2,070 acres of beachfront property they purchased. The land was foreclosed on in August and auctioned off at 11 a.m. on the front steps of the Walton County Courthouse. I will sell to the highest and best bidder for cash at the front door of the Walton County Courthouse in Definiac Springs, Florida, at 11 a.m. on the night day of December 1987, the following described property situated in Walden County, Florida and set forth in said final judgment to wit. Including reporters, about a dozen people showed up. Reading the legal description took about 30 minutes. When it was all over, only one bid was made. Do I have a bid? Plaintiff will bid $1 million. $1 million. Once, twice, three times, and so to St. Joe Paper Company. The court set the price of what was owed to St. Joe Paper Company at $152 million. Since St. Joe Paper Company was the original owner and the only ones to bid, they did not have to pay the million dollars to themselves. Their only cost today was 40 bucks, which is the cost for holding the auction. The future of the land could be sold again. Yeah, if they haven't relayed any plans of what they intend to do with the property or anything no. like that? Not to me. They haven't indicated whether or not they want to sell it? Oh, I'm sure it's still for sale if um, the price were right. But if you're in the market for a prime beachfront property, you can be sure it's going to cost you more than the $40 St. Joe Paper Company paid today. In Walton County, Glenn Austin, TV7 News.